leads the, the army to the battlefield. He told them, we'll send you a messenger and let you know about the result of the battle and what to do in both cases. The messenger left the battlefield um, with his shield, his helmet, his heavy sword and his spear. He ran to the city and told Greeks, uh, Greek people, the women, the children in the city, we won Nani Kikamen. People knew exactly what to do after that. They climbed on the Acropolis rock, Philopapos Hill, Lycabetus, every high point of the city, on the roofs of the houses, and they pretended that the city was guarded. So when the Persians did exactly what Miltiades was afraid about, when they surrounded with their ships the peninsula of Athens and tried to attack the city from south, they saw all these people from a distance from the coastline and they thought that the city is guarded by more soldiers who were not at the battlefield. They thought they had, thought they had seen the Athenian uh, army um, in the, at the battlefield of Maratha and that it would be easy to conquer the city, try a second time. So they cancelled that. They, um, they returned to Persia and in 1896, for the first time, Marathon becomes an Olympic sport during the first Olympics of modern era. And in Delphi, ladies and gentlemen, we'll see a small marble building a treasury house dedicated to Apollo, god of justice, light and music, dedicated by the Athenian government. And in Olympia, Miltiades left his helmet. The general of the army responsible for this great victory during the first Persian invasion dedicated his helmet to God Zeus in, its, uh, in his uh, shrine in Olympia.